Well, hello, guys. Okay. Gonna do uh, unboxing first. Gonna be using these switches. Put them off to the side. And this is the boy. Ray Studios. Space 65 R2 Cyber Voyager. Yep. The colorway is white gold. I was stuck between this and ocean. I also. Ocean and Robocop is what I uh, debated getting. Ooh, terminal also, the terminal colorway. My favorite color is green, so I w I'm a sucker for green. But in the end, I ended up getting the white gold because I just, you know, I don't have a white board. And I did get the maja and green, so I figured, you know, is okay. Let me just make sure everything's all good. Okay, already, already. Hard to open. So I'm sorry if you end up hearing some murmurs in the background or something, because I um, currently have some people upstairs that are. God damn. Construction and also tells you the default layers and stuff, but um, it is via compatible right out of the box. I've been told, so you know, I'm not worried about that. And I will. I have already opened the PCB for testing, 
just to make sure um, it wasn't warped. But uh, yeah, I will also test it one more time. This is the foam between the PCB and plate, and then this is the bottom one. Pretty, it's, I don't know what it's gonna do. It's like super thin compared to this one. It, it's like, it's a comparable thing, like an incomparable thing. This one's almost like three sheets of paper. This is thicker boy, but I guess this, okay. That aside, uh, I like the packaging. It's PCB. Crinkle, crinkle. Oh, shoot. Thank you for the follow, the Spix. Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing today? Yeah. Like I said, I did open and test this already, but I will do it again. To unboxing. Yes, yes. Unboxing and build stream of Space 65 R2 Cyber Voyager. I like the PCB a lot. Very nice. I'm excited to see how the diffuser is, how it turns out. Um, sorry, autofocus is, yeah, okay, alrighty, we'll test this in a little bit. Oof, here we go, yes, I don't know what this is. Just foam. <laughs> Here is the big buoy. Oopsie daisies. Didn't mean to do that. Oof. Just a nice little L badge. Black. Hey, I really like this. I really like this. The white gold. Cyber Voyager. I was con. It looks sick. Yeah, I was contemplating getting a extra green green badge. I don't know, but uh, I I ended up not getting any extras. I just wanted it as is. Carbon fiber plate. Here's the bottom black black little weight situation over here space 65 I don't know how well you can see it yeah wow I like it looks real clean all right the brass makes it come to life oh yeah and the tools let's see what we got in here Fifth packaging so far. Okay, so yeah, they said gray studio tweezers for you to test the PCB, which I will do despite me having tested it already. Ooh. The little driver. Gray Studios. Sorry, autofocus is not that great. Yeah, that's not gonna. Ooh. Mm. I would probably stick with my own driver. It's okay. Um, okay, this is the hardware. The screws, probably extra because everything's already um, in there. And then the little driver. Okay, I'm gonna need this. Mm, it's a bit wheely. This is H 2.0. Okay. At first, I thought it was AirPods. 
Okay. All right, this fix. Uh, hardware, this seems like. Yeah, some extra surface mount stuff. Just some LEDs, some RGB LEDs, some diodes. Okay, that's fine. I, I don't think I'll need to replace them, but it's nice that they gave me this. Oh, another AirPod. Oh, these are the little rubby leggies. Gonna have to put them on before. Hmm. Should I? We'll see, we'll see. I'll clean my surface. I don't want to scratch it, but I also don't want to put the legs on. Oh, okay. The Gray Studio provides us with some rubber, rubber gaskets for your stabilizers. Is it nylon? I think it said nylon. Hold up. Do not fret, y'all. I have the paper right here. We've prepared a collection of accessories. If you use screw and stabilizers, please add the nylon gasket between the screw. Okay, it's nylon. Cool, cool. Appreciate it. What switches will you be using? Um hit exclamation mark build all parts tells you everything today i'm going to be using the drop v2 holy pandas hey you got it boss oh and this is diffuser is this a replacement or no that looks like uh, there is a diffuser in here Ooh, this is soft. I always thought the diffuser was a hard, a hard plastic. I guess not. Okay, that is it for these little tools things. I will put this to the side so I can use it with the stabs. And I will be tossing everything else into here because I, I don't need it. Okay, oofy boofy. Man, this looks nice. Sounds a bit. This plate though. <laughs> uh, my first carbon fiber plate. I've I haven't um never worked with anything other than alu and brass. So. I am excited to see how it will sound. Yeah, I'm not I'm not afraid of thinking this up. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, so take another look before I just I put it to the side uh, as I work on the other thing. have enough uh, space on my desk so you know i've only tried alu and brass plate might try fiberglass or plateless build oh yeah i, I have i have um gingham zion car yian cars like first iteration not the one for sale on like novel keys right now that was a plateless it had some borked screws but um playlist is interesting the feel i don't i don't think i like it that much but uh, you know i use that for work all right it's just is this oh yes you know what i will have to move this Oof. I don't. 
and my lighting situation is not the best. <laughs> so, what a pretty PCB though. Yeah, I agree. I really, I really dig this. Okay. So, oop, let me. As we can see, it just boots into via without any hassle. So, I think it'll be good. Alrighty. Tweezers, Gray Studio. Let's test the matrix. Oh, it's so bright. Gonna go through this one more time. I've done this already, so just try to speed it up. Get around to the build. Uh, I'm not doing anything crazy for the layout. Um, just a standard. I was thinking of going seven new space bar. But, um, I don't know if I will. Also, I normally ask chat what caps lock to go, stepped or regular, but uh, I don't have much viewers. <laughs> and normally my, my mod friend watches me and I normally ask for her opinion, so. But she's not here, she has class and school so seems to be working so far yeah yeah just a good practice to test because lord knows i'm not paying for a replacement pcb <laughs> this face is all good Uh, this is what key is this? Yay! <laughs> wow, the space you are overflowing with enthusiasm. I thank you very much for that. It makes the build stream also a more enjoyable process with people that you know really passionate about it like i am yeah i enjoyed the build that's also why i don't do hot swap it's because um i i i, I enjoy the build process too much to just do <laughs> hot swap but i i do think uh hot swap is good for people that want to test out switches and stuff because I can't do that whenever I you know I want to switch anything I need to completely desolder it which I don't I don't mind now but uh, some I, I do imagine it's you know alrighty I already prepped the stabilizers ahead of time because, you know, I bought a GK61 so I can try and play around with different switches and stuff. Yeah, yeah. And I feel like keyboards now are, they're getting more affordable, like non-custom ones. Like I know, I mean, what is it? What's some popular pre-builds ducky right uh i've i know about royal kludge sk gk 61s all those i've personally never used any of them i did think about getting one just for them but i have oh yeah this is just show you this was my first first build like a year and a half ago just the rinky dinky kbd fans yeah the dc60 pcb this whole thing was like one something ducky's kind of overpriced right 
yeah ducky is like the high end um whatever yeah and like i don't know i really enjoy this i really enjoy this build it just has cheapo gateron yellows but i i enjoy the way it sounds the stabs at this point are a bit rattly but yeah i still type on this a lot and just uh last week i did the maha maja er, ergo maja i can grab that for you if you want you can check out my last stream which was just like a week ago i just built this one this shat is heavy this thing's like six seven pounds i think jeez um yeah i've been enjoying this uh getting takes a bit getting used to but yeah, I had bought the Cyber Voyager, joined in on the Cyber Voyager before um, everything, and then I was gonna either join the Rama Zenith or the Maja, and I decided, you know what? Oh, I'll take the Maja instead. <laughs> But yes, what is your collection, Spix? Oof, all right, I see some little. Um, collection? Yeah, what keyboards you got? Oh, what's going on over here? Am I tripping? Collection, collection. You said you bought the GK61. Is that something like a recent purchase or is it here already? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That little chime was kind of nice though. My favorite is my KBD Fan 65 Tofu Alu case with Lube Telios. V2s, Brass Play, Durox Smoky Stabs, GMK1 and Black. Ooh, wow, GMK1 and Black. Oh, gee, dang. Also comes with a brass weight. Yeah, I feel like KBD Fans does some pretty killer stuff. Like, price, price to product is i mean i guess it's a good place to start really i wouldn't have known where to start if not for kb fans and i still i wanted to um i was actually planning on getting the what's this black friday one i forgot and it's like 106 bucks for the whole pack supposed to like be the nk65 killer no or a contender in that range at least I was thinking of maybe getting a tofu. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna move my screws. Also got a LED in here. Mm -hmm. Alright, 
sorry, sadly gotta go, but thanks for the stream so far, and I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, thanks so much for watching, man. I appreciate it. Catch you later. Good luck with whatever you gotta do. Have a good one. Stay safe. Bye bye. Oof, got some cry talks on here. God damn it. <laughs> Stabs are okay. Alright. It's been half an hour so far, and I've unboxed. And it's almost done with the stabbies. The stabby stabbies. I just need to figure this one out. Take the default layout. Take the plate off the case first. Let's see how that goes. Alrighty. No complaints about the tool, I guess. Oh. Also, it's... 
alternate it. Oh, big bolt. Looks good. Yeah, this is not the best. But not going to complain. Oof. I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's pretty scuffed in the screw hole. If you guys can see this, but it's okay. Don't normally see it, but interesting. Alrighty, top mount. Shiny badge. Oof! I finger, I fingerprinted it up. Ah, shoot. This, this um, diffuser is just here. This badge is. You can just yoink it, I guess. Cool. Alright. I'll we'll take that. I'll wipe you down later, my dude. see this but it says batter slot I think they mean battery slot it's kind of fun <laughs> I don't know what's in here now batter, batter slot this should be just Uh, it's probably all right. I got it. I see. I see. I see. Okay. Oh. I simply needed the plate, so I'm gonna leave the rest of this here. Badge ready to fall out. Oof. Oh man, my autofocus. All right. Sorry about that, folks. If there is even anyone watching. <laughs> Be careful when I screw this back in, I feel. These screws are really close to the edge of the top. 
I'm kind of nervous about scuffing it up, you know? Wow, this is really light. That's why it's carbon fiber. It feels a lot more plasticky than what I thought carbon fiber would be, but, you know. All right, just gonna put this one away. And away I do by off to the side. Starting is going to be interesting. Gonna be using Ursa. I really, <laughs> really don't dig the new the GMK trays. These new boys, which is pretty sad, but we will have to make do with them.
No, for God, I don't need this shit. Need the other shit. I think that works. So that means everything else is going to be to the next one. And also this. Yeah, the thing I don't like about Holy Pandas is. Three pin. Hold on, hold on. If this is here, then it should be the other way. Right, because I'm going to use this shift. That's the border. So I should probably be shifted one over. Thank God I caught that before I died. about right with this now and this they all line up okay cool so then that means my space bar goes here and my switch probably goes here That's the case then. This is probably what I'm looking at. This outermost situation over here.
looks good. And then if that were the case, I have two more. Am I going to outskirts? Am I tripping? They should fit, right? I think uh, once it's soldered in, okay. So this side is the furthermost, and this side is okay. Cool, got it. Stabilizer situation, and then I can get soldering. Did not choose hot spot for this because I oh personally enjoy um, building experience. And hot swap kind of takes away from that, the soldering experience. I enjoy soldering. Always like doing it for projects and stuff. So when I got into keyboards, it was just a big plus because then I get to solder however many <laughs> switches. anyone's in the chat but how are you guys doing if there is someone present if not I'm just talking to myself and that's I'm used to that <laughs> okay pretty sure everything's in the right spot if it's not you know you know it happens. I just don't want to deal with um, <laughs> another situation because for my manja. Oh, I forgot to ask Spix if I should do stepped caps or regular caps. Is there anyone in chat right now? I really don't. I normally don't really care for stepped or not stepped, but uh, I guess since there's no one here, I will just. Uh, we'll just do regular stuff. Regular caps it is. Okay. You 
verified that this is the layout. Just try to make sure this phone piece is aligned properly. It seems like it. Okay. So spacebar is a little tiny bit warped, but uh, you know, gonna have to deal with it, I guess. You know what? I'm just gonna spoosh. if it's better without this light. Nope, you see my big fat head shadow. Okay, it's fine. Forget the LED light. Gotta remember that. <laughs> yeah, I figured I was doing that much. Okay. These portions where there's not a lot of plate are gonna be pretty loose, like this this one right here is. Gotta solder those first. It's just shaking loose. Alright, alright. Alright, champ. I'll take care of you later. I 
regular. Oh, damn. Just want to make sure I didn't bend any of the legs. I think it was good so far. What's the deal, yo? be tough. I really don't want to push it down like this and start doing this to the switch. Okay, maybe it's just that switch. I don't know, man. Well, I'll figure it out. Just a switch, I guess. Hmm. All right, that's, that's fine. Just hope there isn't another one like that. Maybe the dimensions are not that good. this one in here just just because I can't I'm wondering if it's something about the switch all right an hour now that's all right I'll, I'll finish um, relatively quick at this rate then I'm just gonna move some things over to put this in the room. It'll give me a little bit more room. This tool, I don't need any. Switches. Just put them here. Oh, 
really glad they provided these little nylon stabilizer gaskets. Didn't, didn't think they'd uh, come with that. Okay. So. Now I'm gonna. Extractor here. Um, I can zoom in, I guess. This bad boy that keeps falling out. I'm gonna have to this. All right, I'm gonna tack a couple down just on the corners and then. I think that's that's good. <laughs> Alrighty. So let me see how loud this is and how I'm gonna adjust. See how that is. Okay.
plan right now is just to drop some solder and then secure it. Because I feel like I can't push it down and apply solder at the same time right now. Thanks for following Kevo Train One Two Three OP. How you doing? If you're 
curious about what we're building today, you can uh, use the command uh, exclamation mark build and parts. If you have any questions or curiosities, feel free to ask me in chat. I'll try my best to explain and I'll tell you more about it. Using drop holy pandas. Drop me two holy pandas. You sound young as fuck. Oh. How old do I sound? I guess I sound young. <laughs> like mid teens. No, I'm 22, my dude. I just graduated college this year. <laughs> it's the first time someone told me I sounded young. Thank you for tuning in. Viewership's hard to come by these days. I'm gonna have to do a second pass and just make sure all these switches are. So those anchoring switches aren't really doing anything. color you get? White gold. Do you want me to show you right now? We did unboxing and all that jazz before. Nah, that's sick though. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully I finish this soon and just get to assemble it so you could probably still catch it. I don't plan on taking too much time with this. I should have uh, thought about using the holy pandas because they're just too pen. Three pen, my bad. See the switches. Not getting pushed in all the way. Okay, I'm just gonna have to do that. Right I got this and then just. Have a train did you join in on the Cyber Voyager 2 or just or just uh, interesting? The what? Uh this board, the Cyber Voyager. Are you familiar with uh, group buys or oh okay, cool, cool, cool. That's cool.
are you just like uh, interested in it or do you also oh, I'm too broke right now and I'm investing in PC a hey, probably the better investment is a keyboard if you don't got a good PC. What PC were you planning to build? But a hey, boards don't lose their value as fast as PC parts. True, true. If anything, the board's value goes up because uh limited edition supply and demand alright I think I was doing it this is a way better thing cause one of the legs is significantly shorter than the other I think I would have benefited from applying more pressure earlier now these switches up here are not that flush. I'm building the Cooler Master and the Dominity. Oh, cool. All right. Debating whether or not I should desolder. do this the right way because there are some switches that are not sitting as flush as I want it to. Alright, now I know how to deal with <laughs> three pin switches. <laughs> Actually, this corner is fine. What solder iron are you using? Uh, nothing fancy. It was just like a $50, $40 one. It's lasted me for a good two years of like projects and stuff. Slaughter a lot of things like this. But people generally can you just attempt yeah, 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 it's a knob. Generally, people use the hack of soldering irons. That was too expensive of an investment at that time for me, and I just I just stuck with this, and it's been good to me. So I would probably get that later on when this one dies, or get those um, more portable ones now, like the TS80, I think. if the fan volume is like too loud because I have the fume extractor running and I don't know how loud that turns up Oof. it's bearable it might be a little overpowering though yeah I can move my mic higher. Maybe try to. Yeah, my mic is like fans right here, and then the mic's right here, so. I could crank it down a little bit. You know what? Never mind. I don't know. I <laughs> try my best to finish quick. <laughs>
We got RTX voice. Uh, nope. Uh, just running a Blue Yeti microphone. There's any filters on OBS? Probably is, right? Filter out the inhumane frequencies. Okay, there is. Definitely. Scoozy this further away. If you were to go for a keyboard, would you go for a custom? Or get one of the pre made? I mean, my first. Oh man, that was so long ago. My first mechanical was a uh, Razer from like 2007, 2008. Got a custom, of course. Hey, I mean, some people dig the duckies and the and pros or to all their own. a viewer here before who was getting a GK61. No judgment, no judgment. The GM MK Pro looks promising. Oh yeah, I was debating if I should hop on that myself, but I don't really care for hot swap as I enjoy the building process more. But I can see how that's going to disturb the market a bit. Get a lot more beginners into mech keeps. But I did get the Kara, Rama Works Kara, and that's my first hot swap board. It's the HHKB layout, so I don't know how much I'm going to like that. Kara looks sick, yeah. I got the Soyu color. I wasn't really happy with how the translucent uh, cases looked. The renders, the renders, I was very happy with how the rendered looked, but the... Just a split backspace. Yeah, and it's hot swap, so I can't even get the normal. So that's my only qualm about the HHKV layout. If anything, it'll be my test board. I'll be able to try different switches because it is hot swap. But yeah, I'm very excited to see how it sounds. Rama works. It's pretty top notch. Advertising, at least. Marketing. <laughs> Stop time. Hour thirty. Okay. Rama, some of the top slide stuff. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I was gonna join in on the Zenith. But then I went with the Ergo Maja and no regrets, no regrets. Cause that is already here and built. And I know that Rama's gonna take some time. <laughs> Don't they have
have a PC case too? I'm not sure how that is. Or at least they're coming out with them, working on it. They do? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they do. I saw it on their site. Or it's, it's either something they're working on or... Collab. It's kind of cool. Yeah, they seem to do some pretty... You know, they do like film cases too for like cameras. Interesting. They're doing some pretty out there stuff. I love how this PCB looks. Three studios, no disappointment. Oh shiz, it looks so small and it's made for water cooling. Yeah, it's like a small ass case. I think that's a thing, right? There's a market for small PCs, small towers. I don't even think we would call it a tower in that case. But pretty cool stuff. Never tried water cooling, but I probably will try that out in the near future. Oh yeah, it's a small form factor. It's a huge market. Yeah, yeah. I never, I don't know. That didn't. That really made like a. At first, it didn't seem intuitive because, you know, smaller case. Closer are all these components. It's harder to dissipate all that heat, but uh, I guess people are really finding a way to huge market. Yeah, it's aesthetic stuff, right? You gotta watch Dave 2D's like <laughs> he, he had a he had a small small form factor PC. In there. It's interesting stuff, yeah. I think probably if. The specs are like the performance, it's worth it without having to go crazy with the cooling or the I want to build my own PC too in the future, but I'm just not sure. But people found many cool ways to fit like three right, yeah, yeah, that, that stuff is that stuff is pretty fascinating. Uh, I watch, I just enjoy building things, watching people build things. Oh, since you're a PC builder, you probably, you watch Christopher Yee? Does, does he, like, release his budget build and stuff? I feel like it's probably really popular. Yeah, 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 he's cool, he's cool. I think I tuned him to a couple of streams. And I know he's uh, into building keyboards too, so I'm surprised. All these hobbies overlapping. Wallets, wallets are dying. Do you watch Optimum Tech on YouTube? He's like the king of small. No, I haven't. Never specifically went into it. Hey, alright, thanks for the recommendation. I'll be sure to check him out. Optimum tech. Cool, cool. Sounds good. I used to watch a lot of woodworking, but now I don't really have enough time or keep up with it. That's the type of the DIY. That's the type of DIY I used to enjoy. Like watching people like make their own furniture, joinery, this type of stuff. Now I just watch tech, tech tubers. <laughs> also, because they just have a lot of more content, you know, when you're waiting on someone to 
make like a woodworking project it takes them a lot more time but tech tubers i mean they got a new product every day to review so after some time i just lost i just stopped keeping up with the woodworking stuff but now that i have a little bit more time probably go back into that's sick yeah yeah i really enjoy woodworking joinery that stuff is, is really neat i want to build my own loft bed soon for my house <laughs> There's like a shit ton of tech content now that stuff is finally releasing. Yeah. Really neat, really neat. Tech. Gotta remember to check him out. Now I have something to watch when I eat. <laughs> oh man, I'm so excited for this to come together. there just about a little more a little less <laughs> I'm sorry folks I really can't wait to get rid of this fume extractor because I know it's loud Solder really has a lot of flux. It's like flint. Nah, it's cool. Nah, you just saying that. Kill the train. Regardless, I try to. I want people to have a good experience here. Good time. It's not that bad. Okay. All right. I trust you. I trust you. sure what I should do with streaming. I really enjoy it, but sometimes I just run out of personal things. To do. <laughs> I have too much keyboard tonight. I really don't think I'm going to keep spending that much money. I think after the Cara, Cara, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be good. Actually, I don't have a TKL. I might get a TKL. And then I'm kinda set. I have an Ergo. I have a 60%. This is 65. I don't really care for any other layouts. Uh, maybe I'll just do builds for people. Do free build service. What are some of your other hobbies, Kevlo Train? Or anyone in chat. I feel like you're the only one in chat. It's just like before, there's uh, another viewer that was the only one talking. Probably the only viewer, I don't know. I 
20k just got into cubes recently this year. Oh, okay. No other hobbies? Like physical? Uh, I guess, yeah. I mean, I, uh, my other hobbies. I like to skateboard, even though I don't do much of that now. Or longboard, actually. And I practice Taekwondo. But I haven't been able to do that recently either, because I was just trying to make a living and have time for shit during the pandemic. <laughs> Almost there, folks. Almost there. Alright, I sh probably should be sh shouldn't be saying almost there just yet. <laughs> almost, almost there. Alright, how's that? do I have? Yeah, I think on my page it says, shit, let me try to think. Uh, yeah, I got a May pad, which is a through hole numpad kit. Gonna build that probably next week. And got that 2%, the 2% milk. A uh, little cute um, macro pad. So I'm looking forward to that. I actually ordered some damn 0703 mil max sockets, but I think I threw them out. <laughs> or my mom threw them out. Because I left them in the package. I remember I counted them. It was like 50 bucks <laughs> from Mill Max, and it's just, I couldn't find them, it wasn't in my, I was like, ah, shit, probably, she probably threw them out. So I'm debating whether or not I should order some more, or if I should just consider that a lost cause. <laughs> oh, that's rough. Yeah, I was uh, planning on using the Mill Max on this. But, you know, it do be like that. <laughs> Pretty sure she threw it out, man. Pretty sure. That's what I get for leaving things in the original uh, packaging, I guess. I had, I was supposed to put in my toolbox with the other tools I had, but I messed up. Damn, that's hard. Forty, almost two hours. Uh, I got GMK Ursa to go with this. So I hope this turns out a handsome boy. 
think it will. <laughs> but I might just be biased. And that's the loose one that I got down. Thanks to my squeaky keyboard tray that you hear. I got an old rinky dinky desk. I forgot who did this PCB. Was it Old Cat or Eric Potter? Wait, actually. I think they might have did the design instead of the PCB. I'm reading by demo by demo S right here. So I'm guessing that's probably who the PCB created is. I'll look that up when I So build the Ergo Maja last week. I could show that on stream afterwards. Okay. Holy smokes, are we done? Oh, we are not done. I almost forgot. This is why I was not supposed to move this. Alright, because I'm gonna install LED for the caps lock. But first I will make sure everything works. Right now, taking a look, I don't think I missed anything. Um, I don't know if you guys can see. Okay. Oh, okay. Solder stuff is dangerous. Tester, test the matrix. Just bring us down. Okay, cool. No, it's a little bit too bright. Let's <laughs> just skip there. Okay. All right. Well, everything registered on Via. We are good to go. All right. I probably wanna. Man, there's all these little um, flux and solder pellets.
from the heating of it. And it just... What's your opinion, guys? Do you like... I personally like dedicated um, indicators for like caps lock and stuff. But um, almost all the keyboards I buy don't have that. <laughs> I mean, because, you know, they're 60%. I get it. But, yeah, I personally really like it. And now I have to get around by putting a LED. <laughs> so in caps lock, I'm sitting here. So that means positive, negative. Yeah, Tandy, yeah, I, same, same, oh, it's the other way. Most PCBs have the two extra pins for the left, yeah, yeah. It's just, sometimes I forget. And depending on what it is, I mean, even these LEDs, they, they don't do a good job of, you know, reflecting, depending on your keycaps also. So sometimes I I don't know. And my cap locks are on or not. <laughs> Alright, gotta... Crank my solder back on. This is, this is gonna be quick. Alrighty. Alrighty. I think this is straight. Looks pretty good. Sorry, fam. We're almost there. <laughs> and now I need to see if the software includes this. That's a lot nicer. Okay. I just want to make sure you just kind of flood the whole solder plate, solder pad. Sorry. Sometimes it just doesn't flow that well. Get my pliers out to cut the legs of these LEDs. Just gonna have them trim. Normally, when I cut them, I try to just differentiate between negative and positive for later on, but I don't, I'm not gonna have any uses for this. Alright. They're well below the pins, so shouldn't have any issues with that. All right, let's just see if the indicator light works. Oh, hey, here we go. Okay. Awesome sauce. Just gonna put this away. I'll clean this later. You guys don't have to see this. If 
you guys hear it ringing? That's my home phone. And I apologize for that. Okay. My hands are a little bit dirty. Alright, I'm gonna go wash them first. But I'll be right back. And here is the thing. Alright, hold on. wipe this down but it's so nice nice diffuser going on alright so this is just held up by a magnet this little badge I actually thought it was held down by a screw. But nope, it's just a magnet. But yeah, sorry about the lighting. It's probably not that accurate. It's only accurate at some angles. But nice, nice blocker. Not sure how I feel about it until I see it. Shoot, I should probably zoom out. Oof, already. Derp to derp. Am I derping out? Really don't want to scratch this. I was just dumb dumb and my switches. Are the outer edges. And these are the darkest. I'm just gonna keep the rest of the trash in here too. So, uh, this is the Gray Studio tool it comes with. could just get use your own dough. Oh shoot. 
Wait, what the? Am I? <laughs> Damn magnet. Shiz. The screws are kind of pretty close to. Um, is this not magnetic? Nope, it's not. Shoot. I'll look for that in a bit. Top mount, no fancy gasket mounts or anything. Do not see the screw. Oh, found it. Bless. Top mount is still pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like top mount. I don't. Just uh, everyone these days seems to be going for a zig gasket mount. Here's the little foam it comes with. It's super, it's super thin. I don't, I'm not really sure what it's supposed to do. Maybe it's just supposed to prevent any shorting. I don't know. <laughs> but it's really thin. I'm not sure how well it would, what it's gonna add for staff. Pretty shiny L badge. It's just attracting fingerprints. Something's not lining up. Going in on one end, but not so much the other side. And then I got this L badge that doesn't want to stay still. I'm looking to get this end. Truly not true. Oh, okay. 
Hey, God bless. I don't know. I don't know what that was. <laughs> and uh, top screws are alternating. I don't know what the purpose of that was. Is this a design or for because of functional actual design? It's a pretty squeaky tool, not gonna lie. I've said this like two, three times before already too. <laughs> but I gotta get a screw drop count. How many times in a stream I dropped it? Freak it. <laughs> Steps caps or regular caps? I've asked this every time because I normally ask the stream regular. Yes, nice. Um, I know some people. I I I also like the aesthetic of stepped, <laughs> but functional wise, there there's nothing. You eh, I don't really like the way they look. Oh, okay. I probably need to get bump on boys. I don't like the way they look. Oh, wow. That's cool. Nice. I'm gaining some perspectives through today. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys saw this before, but all the tools that it comes with. Um, now that I'm done with this, I could put this away. Uh, they have some LEDs and spare diodes. Uh, I don't know. They come with a nylon gasket it's for your stabilizers. Gray Studio branded tweezers. They include a screwdriver? Yeah, this driver was uh, included in the package. Gray Studios. That's sick. Yeah. And then just your little bit driver. That's pretty badass. Yeah, people really enjoyed it, but it's kind of squeaky. squeaky. <laughs> Spare screws. It's no iFixit kit, but it works. You're right. <laughs> You're right, pumpkin. And uh, the rubber leggies. I should have put this on first, but I really didn't want to. It is what it is, Kevo Train says. You're right, you also right. I don't want to put the bump bonds up here. Cause um I'm I'm probably gonna I plan to, oh yeah, I mean, while I'm at it, I should just show you. It also comes with another little diffuser thing for the badge. It's it's like a gummy. I didn't know that. I, I actually thought it would be um, like a hard acrylic piece. But yeah, the diffuser is a gummy and you got uh, two spares. So ooh, that's the tool that's the tool tools of six space sixty five cyberboard. Mm. 
gummy mod. <laughs> you already know, my dude. Is that, who's that? Is that Alex? Alex Totos? Let me see. Yeah, Alex Topog. Alright, cool, cool. Space 65 is such a nice board. It's a shame I'm out of money to pick up extras. Yeah, sad. It's such a. When I saw the R1, I was like, damn, that looks really good. And so when R2 came out, I was like, yeah, I got it. I gotta do it. Just gonna use me own little bump ons because I don't want to. Uh, these will be temp. <laughs> is this is this too aggressive of an angle? Hold up. Oh shoot. I think R1 was the board that really p piqued my curiosity and made me end up exploring. Oh wow. I don't. Wow, really? Interesting. Um, well, I, I was in the hobby around like 2016. And I, I just liked um, the you know like mechanical keyboards it wasn't there wasn't a specific design or anything but i just wanted a better typing experience and at that time it was just like razor boards the satisfaction 75 is what started it all for me pumpkin says oh thank you for the follow shen kazaki sorry i not that great with reading stuff sometimes. <laughs> All right, you know what? If I regret it, I regret. I had a Razor Black Widow for like four years. Thought it was a shit until I got my first hot swap board. Yeah, I thought my uh, Black Widow Ultimate X Stealth Edition No RGB. was the shit <laughs> and then um my first board was this this was my first board uh dz60 kbd fans run of the mill literally basic ass board but i like it, it has gat yellows uh the stabs are so dead by now damn muted looks so nice this is like the PBT muted. Got it for like 70 bucks on K, K Pre Public. I remember PBT though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the PBT set. It's not the actual GMK muted. I am not Rich Boy and I did not join. <laughs> but yeah, I really. I like I like Gatter on Milky Yellows. I was gonna buy a set, but ending ended up going with EPBT sushi. Hey, nice set, nice set too. I decided to get one of these. Oh, actually, I should show y'all the board, huh? USB C cut up, not bad. Cyber orange. I need a custom cable next. Yeah, yeah. I make I make my own cables, but I just um, I I just did. I just wanted to use one of these uh, magnetic ones, so I wouldn't keep effing up the port, because I kind of want to preserve this well. Oh, please zoom, autofocus. I don't know. Yeah. I have a magnetic one to charge my headset, lol. Yeah, it's just, it's so convenient. I don't know. Space 65. <laughs> Disregard my bumpy bump buns. 
Uh, weight wise, it's pr pretty uh, pretty standard. Not heavy. Not heavy like um. Let me grab this. This is what I built last week. Holy shit, this is heavy. The Ergo Maja. This shit is heavy. All right, you want a drop sound test? Okay, this is. That is the Space 65. And then this is... Oh, shit. And it leaves the bump on feet. All right. But I really like it. I have novelty creams in here. This is the first out of all keyboard streams I've, I've done. No, I mean, people normally have like scales. I don't really have a scale for weighing it. So I just, I can't show how heavy it is any other way. <laughs> so I just drop it. I love it though, keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it, pumpkin. But yeah, I like, I like this. It's a bit getting used to, but hey, thank you for the follow, pumpkin. But yeah, travel was definitely a lot more. And you know, <laughs> this shit ain't going away until like an hour or two. I just want y'all to know. Following for more drop tests in the future. All right. Okay. All right. Maybe I dug me own. Oh, excuse me, phone. Excuse me. Are you not autofocusing? Drop test. F the mazu my. <laughs> I'd love to see a U80 drop test. It might actually break your desk. Because <laughs> I have a little rinky dinky desk. And all right, hold up. I gotta hold up. See, autofocus is okay until this point. Please, 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 computer, please. I'm sorry I shouldn't have dropped a manja. I'm sorry. All right, we're going to have to. Oh. All right. Whenever you feel like freaking focusing, mate. No keycaps type test? What do you mean the keycaps are on? A am I am I tripping? Do you guys not see the keycaps on? <laughs> Dude, I want this to focus. <laughs> We're using theirs. Y you see, you see it. The caps, they're already on. They're not in the packaging anymore. Mate, you guys are trolling. You guys are trolling. Kevin thinking he's slick. Gotta do a type test with no caps. 100 words per minute before you get to. Is that Jim? <laughs> <laughs> I hate these fucking trays, man. <laughs> okay, do you want me to try typing? I don't try. Man, I just want this to like focus, you know? GMK calcium. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, you guys are, you guys are, you guys are too much. <laughs> Wait, no, seriously, though. What's up with the autofocus? GM $200 GMK in this year. Damn, it's been a year since Urso. That's long. Yeah. I mean, it just... All right. Okay, what is the deal with this? Okay. Hold up, guys. I'm so sorry. Just gonna Ursa reminds me of a. Right, I'm just gonna stop this and then do it again. Ugh, bless, bless. <laughs> okay, just a simple restart did it. Ursa reminds me of a less saturated camping. What's the theme behind the set? Um, I think Ursa was um for Lake Tahoe, no? Or some some lakes donation. <laughs> the camera's too focused on the caps SMH. Alright, alright, Cabo Train. You fools asked for it and you fools shall receive oops derpy derpy oh jeez Wait, does it? Hi, <laughs> you guys. <laughs> wait, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. This isn't working. <laughs> wait, space what? Oh God. I'm crying on the inside. Ugh. All right, make your guesses, folks. No keycaps typing. Oh shit! I'm trying to go for that a uh, hundred percent accuracy. Okay, no mistakes. Oh shoot! Oh my god! All right, at least I'm halfway done. End my misery, please. Oh my god. I hate y'all. This is the worst chat ever. Oh my god. Yo, fudge. I'm trolling. Twenty three words per minute, guys. Twenty three words per minute. Alrighty. Alright, I I think <laughs> pumpkin says still typing faster than me. Alright. I don't know about that. Damn, I can't clip it. Oh. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if. Ha ha, you can't clip it. Ha 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 ha. What do you guys think of the Holy Pandas? This is drop V2. And loop with. Panda sound liddy <laughs> with a uh, Crytox two o five because I don't have any three two o two or I mean three two o three or three two o four. Oh, cheese! What's wrong with me? 
Why do I have function up here? I don't care for it. Ah, I'll change it later. Is the shoe says love HPs and drop V2s are fine IMO. Yeah. I wanted to give them a try. I wasn't really too involved with the whole drama. I didn't realize until, you know, all the reviews and discussions came through. And I was like, shaz, did I mess up? <laughs> but I but I didn't apparently. It was still fine. In my in my opinion. I also have nothing crazy or bad to say about it. Kevo says their bumps have such a nice sound. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You got it. I didn't get any novelties because I was a broke bee. So just a biscuit. I also had PBT Islander and never put it on anything yet. It was either PBT Islander or Ursa on this one, but I figured if I was gonna pay like a hundred something for this. Why did you put on function caps? I, I know, I fucked up. <laughs> hey, Isa got me. Yeah, I said I was gonna change it later. I was hoping they wouldn't notice. If it's caps, why is it facing down? Is it caps or is it shift? Apparently it's caps. <laughs> realize interesting it's so far off first GMK set you guys it was kind of funny too because I spent like a week okay I didn't spend a week I spent like three days debating Uh, whether if I should get uh, I'm dumb I put this here and I kept looking if I should get Ursa or not and I was like you know what I deserve it I've been working hard and then literally the day after I bought Ursa GMK Rudy came out and I was like damn Rudy looks nice too and I was stuck between either buying another one or just But yeah, I'm still happy with, I'm still happy with her, so. I think caps is a down arrow since it's shift, it shifted the letters on the typewriter downward, which allowed the capital letters to, A. All right. Thank you for researching that up, searching that up so I didn't have to. quite a few years since I used a typewriter though. Oh right, that makes sense. I mean this whole format QWERTY was like for the typewriter now or based on the typewriter. I think that's the same reason why the enter icon is down and left. You make in too much sense. We can't allow that and we, we don't allow that in this stream. 
in this channel, alright? Oh, fudge me. What the hell is wrong with me? You seeing this shit? You guys, like, you guys have fun s seeing th this? Terrible. You guys are just terrible, man. I've never really had a tactile sw uh, switch before. So, I regret not getting this board. It's such a nice little layout. Hey, thank you for the follow, Key Labs Keycaps. Awesome name. Yeah, I, I was really debating on getting this or not, but I knew if I, if I knew I didn't get it, I would just, I would regret it. And here I am, regretting a little bit, but I will get over it. Let's just do this. Spacebar. Spacebar is a little bit warped. I don't know if you. I can't. I can't. I can't really. It's a little bit of a seesaw. But, um. Alright. That GMK warp. That's right, boys. Let me just. <laughs> Um, flipped or not flipped. I let you guys see this is a democracy. All right. Flipped. All right. I got one flipped. Ooh, I actually see the streaks. I don't know how to portray this. But I kind of see like vertical. No, sorry. Horizontal like streaks. Inverted gang. I just unflipped mine. So I'm going to say unflipped. 2v1. Please, anyone, to save me from this un this inverted madness. I used to also flip it, but I have changed it back. I am a changed person, alright? No more of that inverted nonsense. Please, guys, one more vote. No one else. God damn it. Alrighty, inverted it is by popular demand. I can also flip it the other way later so you can see how it sounds. Alright, Cabo, you got what you wanted. Just just be quiet now. <laughs> oh, this feels so weird. I haven't seen this in a while. What do you think of the blocker? Why am I showing y'all this yet? It's not even done. Oh, down left, right. Is it just me? I feel like the keycap is kind of rubbing up against the top case. All right, I guess not. That eh, whatever. I'm literally gonna. That looks quite close, though, right? I don't know. Is that um maybe it's the no? I don't. Yeah, yeah. It's good. Also, it's like this is rounded and the keycap is sharp, so it's kind of. I don't know. Eh, whatever. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I literally do not fucking care for this, so I'm just gonna. Would it kill you guys if I put a page up but not a page down? Like, if I just, like, if I put scroll or something here, would that fuck you guys up? 
Oh, oh no. Ah, shit. It's on. Ah, there's nothing I can do. <laughs> oh, we're missing this bad boy. <laughs> okay. Here is YMK Ursa. Uh, please disregard the function row. Honestly, it really wasn't my fault. I wasn't thinking, so it wasn't my fault. What? What's that typing test? It's so pretty. Oh, monkey types. Oh, monkey dash type. Now it's just monkey type. You know what? I've it's been around too long. Um. If you want, I can. I fucked up. Number two. I didn't get the little uh, homing keys. There, there you go, folks. And this theme is um, fundamentals. I personally like green a lot. Yeah. Yo, even the cable got an LED. Oh, yeah, I, I don't know. I just... I thought it'd make more sense if it lit up with, if it was connected, but it... Whatever. <laughs> what do you think, guys? What do you think? Okay, match. Okay, match. All right, let's get rid of this 23 words per minute fucking madness. And it's magnetic revolutionary. <laughs> All right, Kevo is just making fun of me now. And honestly, I don't need this. Okay, all right, the build's done at two hours and 40 minutes. All right, not too bad, not too bad. Not too bad, folks, right? Can I get a not too bad in chat, please? For real, that cable is sick, though. <laughs> yeah, I just really wanted a magnetic one because I didn't want to keep janking up the port. Not too bad. Hey, pumpkin. T-Y-T-Y. -T -Y. I'm crying. All right, all right. I know what y'all waiting for. It's disgusting. All you here, are, all you people are here for just one thing. Thing and it's disgusting, but you're gonna have to wait for the typing test. If Iza says actually scuffed, okay. If only the LED was RGB, a pog you, I would kill myself before I used the RGB. <laughs> F row for numbers and scroll instead of page. <laughs> First build 33. Alright, you know what guys, there's alright, should I should I change it to numbers? Will you never get your typing test? Alright, you asked for it, fools. No, actually I like how much this bothers you guys. I, I would I would I can live with this. Okay. Top and Tayas time, y'all. RGB cable pog. Damn. Do you guys enjoy RGB? Uh, no judgment or anything. I used to like RGB, but like this shit bothers me now. Only if it's underglow. Ah, I'm sorry. Literally, my light kind of just... just... What do you guys think of this? Let me, let me do this. Does this more accurately show? 
Only if Underglow, yeah, I read that. Yeah, I also agree. Underglow is Underglow is pretty snazzy. I gotta be in RGB mood. I change it up once in a while. Yeah, but like that rainbow stuff is is a little bit too much. Um, actually, let me see if I could. Oh, that just that just turned it off. I think I think this. Can I just get a white? Ah, fudge this. Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, ah, sh I fucked up. Okay. Cool. Should I put this back on or light or no light? Am I blah 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 blah? Does it cast more shadows? Blah 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 blah. Okay, whatever. Okay, I'll leave the light on. Alrighty. Time. Testing time. Oh, shoot. Alright. Oh, it's so. Alright. Okay, this is. I've been using Gat Milk Yellows, and for those of you know, it's it's significantly. Uh, this is very pleasant, though. How does it sound? I, I I hold on. I'm gonna take off my head. Okay, here. All right, all right. No. Okay, sorry. No, no more, no more interruptions. I'll shut the fuck up. going on outside. I'm sorry guys if you hear the Alright redo redo redo. Holy shit this is terrible. <laughs> oh lord nah nah that ain't cool. Alright I'm sorry guys. It's got a nice clack, and it's back to scuff stream. All right, all right, okay, hold up. Why are you guys so rude? <laughs> Yo, this hobby is full of bullies, my dude. Always has been. Ah, <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, uh, do you guys hear the hogging outside? I don't know what's going on. Maybe someone's holding the whole street up. All right, one more, okay. No mod color pipe. <sighs> you know what? Y'all people are just so freaking, ugh. You want this? Is this what you fucking want? Huh, you want this? Jesus, you guys are horrible. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe I'm... F okay, you're right, Kevo Train Democracy. Okay, fine. That's the only... Alright, you know what? Fine. Fine. I said it myself. You might as well fix that number while you're at it. <laughs> Wait, no, honestly, guys, for real, after all this hard work, all right, it was an honest mistake, okay? 
and this just this is just so so much pressure and stress yeah also I'm not I'm not used to this this is interesting all right so wait scuffed all right come on real real uninterrupted typing test okay all right here we go Okay, 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 okay. Okay, for real now, no more jokes, guys. Stop fooling around. Stop fooling around. Terrible. <laughs> Space bar sounds good. Alrighty. Don't mess up 120. Alright, I can hit 120 on a linear. Alright, you know what? I'll, I'll try. I'll try one more time on this. Alright, let's try and hit 120, okay? But I'll let you guys hear the mod. 69. Alright. F off, Kerbo <laughs> One more test. No one's leave. All right, no one's leaving until we hit 120 on this. Do I have? Are we? Are we? Are we comparable on that? You know what I think it is. I mean, I'm a dip. Okay, Camo Trend. Cause I'll be here for a while. Yo, the no trust, absolutely no faith, no belief in me. <laughs> Do you guys want to keep the inverted or shall we flip it up, spice it up? Please, just please let me change this. <laughs> One more. Y'all, y'all city slickers for real. Just, okay. Yo, it's space. Okay, it's space. I'm not, I, I just need to, I tap really lightly. I'm used to just pressing real lightly and it registering, but.
<laughs> the overcompensating at the end. 115 pumpkin. God damn it. Raw 123. Alright, should I just should I just speed run with no fixing errors? Cause I I I don't know. I I, I like be more accurate than Or just guessing as you type along. <laughs> it sounds a lot. Alright. You alright. I can do a typing test on the Maja too if you guys would like. Would you like that? Novel key creams. Hefty boy. Legend says it the the bump on still Oh, still here. Still here. These are from the Maja. These are from the this. <laughs> no lies, folks. You saw it here first. Stops aren't that bad, right? Actually, Ursa might go well if you're mod. Yeah, I was considering using this, but at that time, chat decided that um, the novel keys black on white. They wanted that. <clears throat> so I was like, okay. All right, let me get these. Let me get the fat boy out. Oh, fuck this. It's so heavy, man. Whew. I'm gonna put this aside. Make room for fat boy. That is a big ass key. Oh shoot, I'm dumb. I keep looking for the little. It's it's on this. I gotta. God damn it. I'm dumb. I'm dumb, guys. Why do you let me do this? Why do you let me behave in this uncivilized way? Is all I'm asking. Got to go. Have a good one, brother. Alright, have a good one, mate. <clears throat> Kevo train just gonna miss out. Oh, shoot. Okay, now I'm just having to get used to this format again. What do you guys think of this? What do you guys like better? Needs camping to match fearless types. I don't have camping. <laughs> but yeah, camping would be nice. I think I saw... I think someone with a green Maja put camping 
on it, no? On like, uh, was it mechanical keyboards? I think on Reddit. I think I've I think I've seen that. I wanted to join in on the PC one, but I, <clears throat> I'm glad I did. Because <clears throat> how else am I gonna make the fat boy memes? Look at this shit. <laughs> okay. Oh, thank you for the follow, friend. All right, well, this was today's build. <clears throat> Space 65, white gold, Cyber Voyager. With uh, Drop V2 Holy Pandas and uh, GMK Ursa. And yes, no page down. But we did change the pipe key because I am a person that values other people's opinions, especially those that are strangers on the internet. And I'm gonna, you bet I'm gonna flip this shit around right when I end stream. And then I'll also get rid of function. <laughs> Cause that was my fault. Okay, it was my fault, y'all. What do you think, guys? What do you think? Yay or nay? don't lie guys if i did an hour long typing test would you would you give me views on youtube so i was thinking i would probably film some typing test sounds so i have some youtube youtube videos was finished in like two hours 40 minutes it took a while with the keycaps and because i had a chat to chat with today but yeah thanks for tuning in guys i probably um i have a may pad coming in oh it's already in here actually but i'm gonna build a may pad next week probably so it's a <clears throat> through hole numpad macro pad whatever you guys want to refer it to it as if that's something that seems interesting to you uh tune in next week and i probably might have some <clears throat> typing streams here and there between the week sometimes i just want to like type it maybe maybe you guys want to hear it <laughs> make fun of how slow my words per minute are I average like 130s. It's it's just these holy panda switches. Alright, by next stream I will I will at least have 125 on this keyboard. Alright? That's that's a promise. Alrighty. That's it. I hope you guys have the rest a good rest of your night, your day. The afternoon, I don't know where you guys are, but I'm in New York, so it's dinner time now. Early dinner. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching me. I really appreciate it. 
had a nice time, a nice build. I really like this. I actually really like this. Uh, carbon fiber plate, by the way. I wonder what the brass would have sounded like. But regardless, thanks so much for tuning in. Thanks for following. I really appreciate it, guys. Just me doing a hobby. It's nice to just chill with people, even though they're bullies. But yeah, thank you so much, guys. I'll catch you next time. Until then, peace out. Bye-bye. Thank you.